Hey everybody, how's it going? I'm Satham, and today in this video, folks, I'm going to show you how to get the custom Sentinel XS to spawn for you. So if you folks enjoyed this video, please do not forget to support me and the channel by hitting that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new, and don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you get notified when I upload new content. Now, as you can see, there are two variants of the sentinel xs so that is the yellow version as well as the blue version the yellow one sells for a lot less than the blue one however they are both customized with obviously visual customizations and as such they will sell for a hefty price at the los santos custom shop so the first thing we'll need to do is we'll need to get a hard top two door sports car to spawn it and the next thing you need to know is that these cars spawn Jesus. anywhere in between 10 p.m. to about 3 at the latest 4 a.m. So that is 2200 hours till 2 or 4 in the morning. I think the latest I've seen this car spawn happened to be at 4 in the morning. However, it is not a frequent occurrence. It does tend to spawn quite frequently at midnight. So, as you can see, I've got a sports car. It is obviously a convertible, so therefore not a hard top. But that is because I'm going to show you the route that we are going to take. I'm also going to have the time out via my phone so you guys can see what time it spawns at for me. So, the first thing I'm going to show you is the route that we need to take to get this car to spawn. So, it's very important that you are about two blocks away from the spawn point. And this is the route that I prefer to take. I'm going to show you it via the map. So I'm down here. The car will spawn up there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drive up the hill very, very slowly. And then once I get up there, I will stop for a brief second. Not look into that direction. So do not look at your left. That's just because it gives it a couple of seconds more to spawn. So it gives the game some more time to spawn. The big trick with most of these cars is to drive slowly. So I've put out my phone so you guys can see what time it is in game. So I'm going to do a mock-up run so you guys can see what I'm doing so I can explain it to you as well. Once we get up here, we don't really want to look to our left as sometimes you'll see that it's not there and if you wait here and block traffic for a couple of seconds, the car may spawn in. So normally I wait about four to 10 seconds, then go to my left, and nine times out of 10, the car will have spawned in. Obviously I am driving the wrong car for it to spawn in. You do need a two door hard top car. Okay, now that I found the car that I'm going to use as a spawner vehicle, I'm going to go and get in it. And then we will attempt that run again. This time doing it for real. So I'm going to go down this way again. I want to kind of keep away from the spawn location just so I don't interfere with it. If you do have a friend that is with you, make sure that they are not within the area or... If you're getting the car for a friend, make sure that they are with you. So we're going to start from the bottom here. We're going to make our way up this hill very, very slowly. If you want, you can stop at this intersection for a couple of seconds just to give the game some additional time to spawn in that car. I normally like to go close to the left uh footpath or pavement and i'm gonna stop right in front here so that the cars don't drive past the traffic lights i'm gonna give it a couple of seconds then i will turn left let's see if we got lucky there it is we have the yellow sentinel xs and as i said before you can get this car in two colors the yellow one and the blue purpley one which is the one that sells for the best price at Los Santos Customs. So the next thing I'm going to show you is what these cars sell for and if you want you can either keep them or 
obviously sell them if you want to keep them you will want to put a tracker on them as well as insurance so that they don't get blown up these are free cars that you can keep and store in your garage and you can also sell them for a hefty amount of money at los santos customs okay so the first one we are going to look at is the blue or purple sentinel xs as you will see this is the one that brings in the most amount of money at around or over seventeen thousand dollars if you choose to sell it alternately you can build up a garage full of these and sell one every 50 minutes or so in the game for money and secondly we have the yellow sentinel xs which obviously sells for a significant different compared to the other one and as you can see it sells for less it's still nonetheless a good looking car especially if this is going to be your first car it does come with some visual customizations and it still brings in a bit of money well that is it for this video folks i do hope that you have enjoyed the content here or found it useful if you have please do not forget to support me and the channel by hitting that like button subscribe to the channel if you are new and haven't already and don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you get notified when i upload new content also if you do like gaming and are looking for a nice gaming community to join go and check out lush life on discord it is a good awesome community with a lot of people and everybody's friendly we play all sorts of games with gta included for those interested i will leave a link to the discord down in a pinned comment as well as in the description of this video until next time stay safe folks